A man jailed in Russia for two years is now free after a prisoner exchange. Russian state TV cameras showed Trevor Reed's release. Russia says he was returned to the U.S. in exchange for the release of a Russian pilot held in this country for smuggling drugs. Reed was convicted on assault charges and sentenced to nine years in prison. The State Department says negotiations for his release started months before Russia invaded Ukraine. But families of other Americans still in prison in Russia want to know when their loved ones will go free, and that includes a man with ties to New England. WBZ's David Wade joins us again in studio. And David, Paul Whalen's family is extremely frustrated. Yeah, no doubt about it. The corporate security executive whose sister lives on Nantucket has been in custody since December of 2018, accused of spying. Now, family members tell us they are thrilled for the Reed family that you just mentioned, and Trevor's release gives them hope. But it also leaves them with a lot of questions. They want to know if there was one deal with Russia, why not two? We spoke with Paul's twin, David, today. A lot of people have used the word bittersweet with me today, and uh, and that's true. It's uh, I think. Paul has been there longer uh, in Russia than any other detainee, and we were hoping that he would be coming home first, uh, and that unfortunately is not the case. My parents spoke to him today, uh, and he was obviously extremely disappointed. Uh, they let him know that Trevor had been released, and, and his first question was, why, was, why am I being left behind? And I, I don't have the answer. Whalen tells us that the family is grateful that President Biden mentioned Paul in a statement that the White House released about Trevor, but the family wonders how much harder it will be now to reach a second agreement to secure Paul's freedom. Paula? Thank you, David.